Hi everybody, I learned something new and I always think it's good to share with each other when we did. And um, what I figured out is how to embed Desmos into a Canvas quiz. So if you wanted your students to use Desmos inside the quiz, um, then we can kind of push it in that direction. So if you're into that, great. If you're not, just don't watch this video. Um, so what you have to do is change to the HTML editor. And there's this code that I will share that I'm just going to paste right here. And that tells it to put the Desmos calculator into the frame. Um, so I'm just going to do that. And then when I click back over, you can see it is there like magic. Um, I just wrote a quiz for one of my classes with it. And so how I did the question is I made it an essay question. So before the graph, um, and actually I'm going to switch back to HTML so I can put some space in front of it. I told them what to do. It was actually um, for business calculus, so I wanted them to find the derivative and give me some critical numbers. And all I really want them using the graphing calculator for is to get the y values. Like I don't want them to spend a lot of time doing something else. Um, so now when I click back over, I can just tell it um, that I want to put in, let's do something easy, f of x equals um, x squared minus 4x. So I told them, do the derivative, whatever, I'm not going to write it all out here. But because it's an essay, when I save it, so I'm going to update the question, um, when they go to do it, they have to type it in. So I'm going to hit save. So when I look at preview, then my students will have to come down here and write in the answer. So they're going to have to use the equation editor, like I expect, like I gave better directions that I'm telling you right now. But they would um, do the derivative, right? Um, and they would say it's 2x minus 4. So they can type it for me. You can move this around. So if they forget what the question is, they can go back and look at it. Um, and they could tell me anything I ask them down here. Um, which is nice. So it doesn't let me push enter there. You have to insert and then there could be like a next step. But at least I know they can do some stuff in here. So what I'm really looking for them to be able to do is type in x squared <clears throat> minus 4x here and then they can evaluate um, like whatever number they want to. So f of 2 would be negative 4 or f of 5, right? So just so they have that quick thing to do, um, because I am going to make them use ProctorU on some things and I don't want to say they can't have an online calculator, like it's business calculus, they're, they're not going on beyond that. Um, so I want them to have the tables and the function values, but I don't want them to be able to go over and like use any other site. So I'm gonna stick them only being able to have Canvas. So I had to bring Desmos into Canvas so that they're only allowed on this window. If it's helpful, awesome, if it isn't, Again, just delete me.